Hey guys, your inner chakras, welcome back to the channel guys. If you are new, you are welcome. Guys, we're checking in for your love life in 2025, right? What is coming towards you guys in love in 2025, right? Are you taking any energy from 2024 with you? Are you leaving them? Is someone coming in for you? A new love, past love, whatever, whatever. So what does love look like for you guys in 2025? Let's see what your romance angels have to say for you. Let's see. If you are new here, guys, well, oh, it's a new love in 2025, baby. It's a new love. It says a new person has stirred your romantic feelings. So this may be a completely new person that you probably haven't met. And if you have met them already, then this is going to usher in 2025, right? Mm. It's a new thing in 2025. What do they say? Out with the old, in with the new? Possibly. Uh, you deserve love. You are lovable. So this person here, guys, they're going to... They feel like you deserve love. They feel you are lovable man or woman right everybody deserves love everybody is lovable in their own little way right it's just not for everybody it's just not for everybody everybody's not going to get you and understand you and then it says stay optimistic about your love life positive thinking and faith will bring you romance so guys stay positive you may think that 2024 was a pain in your horse right stay positive don't let that get you down Love is coming in 2025. Let's see what this love is going to look like in 2025. With the Sex and the City Oracle cards. There's one card I already flipped over. Did y'all see it? I saw it. I thought I saw it. I saw something. Maybe I didn't. Maybe I'm seeing things. I don't know. Either way. Let's get it. Shuffle. What this 2025 consists of, right? Oh, Holy Spirit, for the collective, what does 2025 in love look like for those that deserve love and are lovable? It's a new love. What does this new love look like? What does the new love look like? This person here, they're saying, I'm hopelessly in love with you forever yours. So somebody is hopelessly in love with you. If they're not, they will be, and you're going to meet them in 2025. But this is a new love, so you probably met them already. Um, and we're already in November, so you're going to take this situation here if you already met them into 2025. Uh, dinner for two. So you're going to be out eating, probably find a different spots to eat at. You choose, they choose, we choose. You're going to be going out to dinner with this person. This journey wasn't easy. So it definitely wasn't easy for you to get here. It definitely wasn't easy for you to finally find the love that you want, right? It wasn't easy for sure for you or for your person. And my life is so much sweeter with you in it. Somebody's in love. Somebody's going to be in love in 2025. And this person is hopelessly in love with you guys. So this is a good thing. If you ask me, it's a good thing. Alright. Let's see what's going on with this person that's hopelessly in love with you. Something is ending in their life, Ten of Cups. Something could be ending in their life right now. And then here you are, lover. So something is ending, guys, and ushering in this new love for you, for them. A new love is definitely coming in. It's like Beauty and the Beast here. This is definitely a Wheel of Fortune, so it's definitely good things. They're... I guess with you, they feel like it's a will of fortune. It's a good thing. You probably feel the same about them. Your past relationship didn't work. There wasn't any teamwork or anything like that. Or it could have been no teamwork for them. So something has definitely ended in their life or yours, right? And you finally met love. 
Your person could be a hermit right now, just being quiet, getting things in order, but they do want balance in their life. They want to equal give and take with you. Balance is always good. Here they come, guys. They're on their chariot. This is a King of Cups in reverse. They're taking their love away from somebody else as we speak. Maybe they're wrapping it up now and they're going to want to start the new year with you. But they're definitely on their way. They may arrive in 2025. They do not want to go back to their past. They do not want to revisit it. Uh, they could have found out that their person had a...